to show that carbon dioxide is released during respiration. Carbon dioxide is released by the germinating seeds during respiration. This carbon dioxide is absorbed by the potassium hydroxide which is hanging inside the conical flask. Due to absorption of carbon dioxide, a vacuum is created which causes an upward movement of water in the delivery tube. Now answer the following questions regarding this experiment to understand it better. What is the purpose of the germinating seeds in the experiment? The germinating seeds are used to demonstrate respiration, as they produce carbon dioxide during respiration. What is the function of the potassium hydroxide solution in the experiment? The potassium hydroxide solution absorbs the carbon dioxide produced by the germinating seeds. Why is a bent glass tube used in the setup? The bent glass tube connects the conical flask to the beaker with water, allowing any gas exchange to be observed. What causes the water level in the beaker to change? The water level rises due to the vacuum created when carbon dioxide is absorbed by the potassium hydroxide solution, indicating oxygen consumption by the germinating seeds. Why is the conical flask sealed with a cork? The cork seals the flask to prevent external air from entering, ensuring that any observed changes are due to the respiration of the seeds. What does the final level of water in the beaker indicate? The final water level indicates the amount of oxygen consumed by the germinating seeds during respiration. What does the thread do in the experiment? The thread suspends the tube containing the potassium hydroxide solution inside the conical flask, keeping it separate from the seeds. Hope you have understood the experiment well and there are no more doubts. If you have any questions regarding this experiment, feel free to ask in the comment section.